record stores have it. They had one record. Pick it up. It's great. I want to mention the merchandise table. We have some CDs over there. Actually, only Lonnie brought his. So we got Lonnie Knight CDs over there. He will gladly sign them, hang out over there after the show, pick them up. We have posters of the event. We have our donation jars. And what else do we have over there? Guitars for Vets. Guitars for Vets. T-shirts. Hats. 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 Wave the hat. Okay. Watch them. Joker's T-shirts. Joker's Wild T-shirts over there. And um, I think there's a Joker's Wild album you can get. I was hearing. If you have any questions about these guys, just ask them. And um, as I actually stall while they change the drum kit, actually no, that's just not right. I'm going to uh, talk about guitars for vets. Supporting tonight. First of all, do we have any veterans in the audience? Please stand if you do. Just stand up right where you're at. Very nice. All right. Thank you for coming. Guitars for Vets is a nonprofit organization that enhances the lives of ailing and injured military veterans by providing them free guitars and music instruction. By encouraging self-expression and relationship building through music, Guitars for Vets works with warriors to restore feelings of joy and purpose that can be lost after a suffering trauma. To date, we are unaware of any other nonprofit organization with the experience, relationships, and resources to offer therapeutic guitar instruction to military veterans on a national scale. It was founded in 2007 when Patrick Nettesheim, a Milwaukee area guitar instructor, joined together with Vietnam era Marine Dan Van Buskirk and coined the phrase and slogan, Guitars for Vets, the healing power of music in the hands of heroes. Since 2007, Guitars for Vets has completed over 20,000 guitar lessons and distributed over 2,000 guitars to our nation's veterans. 50 chapters have been established in over 25 cities across the country with more being added as resources are available. Please visit our Guitars for Vets information stand. Stand up over there, Mike and Lori Delorier are helping out there. And Jeannie Anderson, would you guys just take a wave over there? And also, for more information, go to www.guitarsforvets.org. Denny, how are we doing? Good. I'd like to introduce two of my helpers. We're going to come out tonight to the crowd. You don't even have to get up. If you could pitch in a little bit, it would help. It's going to a good cause. We've been supporting it since 2009 with these summer concerts. I'd like to introduce Basha Goldwater, who's going to help me. Come on out here from New York City. New York City. Yes. And Johanna Reed from Plymouth. Okay, they have guitars that are going to be restored. We're going to come through and introduce them to every one of you. Get what you can if you're enjoying the night. We're going to be back with this cause for the Salute to the Music of Bob Dylan, July 29th. That, I think, I'll have to check with Vanessa. That's our fifth year, I think. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. It's going to be our fifth concert. They get bigger every year. I'll save you all seats. All right? Thank you again. I would like to introduce, Basha, you can start over there, and Johanna over there. I'll join you in a moment. Are we ready, boys? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Joker's Wild.